I'm on my way to pick up an instrument. I first saw the Harmonica Museum in Zwota and I was so fascinated with it that I tried to find one. And apparently in this neighborhood, somebody is selling one for just 90 euros. So here it is. Apparently the grandfather who played this used to be a musician and he also played in theaters and he had many instruments that he collected and restored. I have high hopes that this will actually work. And if it does, I'm gonna try a trick I learned from Eddie Van Halen. And here we are. Let's open it up. Oh, nice. As you can hear, this is a fan organ. And I've talked about fan organs before, but trust me, this one is amazing. It has five different sounds. And while this sounds beautiful, I think we can hack it. This is a very AC, a variable voltage regulator. You plug this into your power and then you can adjust how much power is passed on through the instrument. And my idea is, to starve this. My hope is that this is similar to only half pulling stops on a pipe organ. Let's see if this works. Power cable goes in here and I bought this actually to power up old equipment safely because sometimes it just breaks if you give it the full 240 volts that you get here in Germany. Power on here. We're very low now. Here you can see how much volt we're getting. Turn this on and you can see it's not turning on. Need to give it a bit more. I can hear humming. And it's starting up. This is incredibly soft and gentle. It sounds beautiful. Let's pull it back a little. the attacks are incredibly gentle. This definitely fixes one thing. 
these type of instruments really only have one attack, a fast one, and they also have a short release. You can create long attacks and releases. And especially if you underpower it, the very, very tiny fluctuations that happen before the signal gets stable in the attack phase are beautiful. That is so much more poetic. Especially now that I've got this weird in-between register where each of the reads is open just a touch. This works safely and it's a wonderful trick to get more out of your fan organ and these are really cheap and the variac is really cheap and it's handy to have around if you've got vintage gear so win-win <laughs> Eddie Van Halen's Marshall amp was too loud, so he bought a second one, and when he plugged that in, it took forever to warm up, but it sounded fantastic, and it wasn't as loud. And that was because it came from England and was still set to 220 volts instead of 110 volts. He fell in love with that sound, so he picked up Variac to do that to all his amps, and hence that starved sound was born. You can power stuff many other things, as many producers like Sylvia Massey have discovered. Even this wonderful Harmona fan organ. Let's employ a trick I learned at Willem Twee. 